What's up, everybody? We're back. We're playing some Trivial Pursuit today. We haven't yeah. played that in a while. Yeah. We're doing some verses. We have Alea with us today. Hi! <laughs> Hi. We're going to try and know things. Oh, and if we're going to fail at knowing things. Probably. But as long as we don't lose to, I don't know, whoever the AI Probably is. Probably Evelyn. It's usually Evelyn. It's always Evelyn. Uh, no, sometimes it's Mackenzie. It could be Mackenzie. Or what is the, is the, what's the guy? Chad. Welcome to Trivial I think it's Chad. 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 <laughs> Looks like a Chad. Uh, who we got with us? Who's our like Carlos or something? Oh, Carlos. He likes puns. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, it's, it looks like it's Let's find out. No, it's player one. No, uh, it's player, player one. Two. That's me. It's player me. Player three. It's player three. That's player. It's player not us. There's the AI we gotta beat. <laughs> Rub got wrong button. Oh, Way to go. I thought I could skip it with. Options, but I couldn't. First round. All right, we're gonna know things. It's quick Hopefully. starter. Time to check we'll out. We'll just this answer it right. Yeah, answer it right and don't be wrong. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Petra. Ah, uh, Petra. Oh, it's science. Ah, uh, yes. Next up is science so What and is nature. a Kia? It's a car. Ah. Uh, uh, sure. Well, we're starting off strong, guys. That one. Everyone. Well, oh, Petra is the only one that got it. I was between fish and parrot. I'm like, it's an I, animal of some sort. I I was right there with you, but it sounded like fish. We all it thought it was a fish. It sounded like it sounded like a Swedish. Uh, a Swedish fish? No, that's sounded, candy. I thought it sounded like a beta. I was thinking like a Arthur Swedish uh, furniture shop. <laughs> what is Atticus Finch's profession in the novel To Kill a Mockingbird? Oh, I know that. I one. know that one. Uh, can I phone a friend? Uh, you've got just four seconds. Uh, I don't know. Oh! oh. Me, you me, went, you me went and Petra, Petra were wrong. Uh, he was a lawyer. Yeah. yeah he, well, I know now. What was he, he defending he, Boo? Yeah, he defended Boo. Yeah. Past and present, History! History! What was the name of my mom's dog? <laughs> the structure is like the one shown here that the Romans built to carry water to towns. I know this one. I do too. It's a camel. <laughs> uh, Camels are weird. They spit. They do. So do llamas and alpacas. It's true. And humans. And uh, they're not Someone a built structure that carry water. Sure they are. They got humps and everything. They're not a built Man, structure. Wasn't that what that was? Humps and arches, it's same thing? Three humps. Pregnant. What country's name is the Native American word for big village? <sighs> Lavos. Big, <laughs> big fire. Uh, I think it's that one? I'm gonna go with... I might be wrong, though. I'm gonna go with Uruguay. Whoa! We've all picked Whoa. something different. Canada, and Petra, really? Petra was the only one that got it. I knew it had to be Canada uh, or Mexico because it was the Native American word. Final question. Here's and your chance. South Americans are still Native Americans, Lee. Yeah. Well, nah. <laughs> Hobbies and food, fun and games. Let's tackle not sports Native. and leisure. I, were they not? No, they're like Native Mexicans. I don't believe that's accurate. <laughs> what is a Berliner in pastry chalk? I only know this thanks to a president being terrible. What? It's uh, it's a it's a famous thing where he was trying to say I'm a Berliner, but instead yeah, one second, but instead he said I'm a jelly donut. Oh, <laughs> uh, damn it! I don't, okay. Equal nine Berliner. That was uh, I forget which president all of a sudden because my brain is dumb, but it's like famous pop culture. That was supposed to be a sports and leisure question. Jelly donut is leisure. Baking is, baking is a hobby. <laughs> no. They put food into the leisure. No. <laughs> Great. Baking is a hobby. I am losing. It could be a sport. Very in hard. Fort it's baking sure. competitions. Baking can be a sport. I'm, I'm sure. in last place. It's okay. It's in only second. the first round. And guess who's in first place? In the uh, AI. Well, yeah, it's because she gets the I, early ones right. I have an excuse. You two, got, you two don't. I was <laughs> Rapunzel for 18 <laughs> years. Nah, it's fine. Uh, guess what? No amount of, like, outward socializing would let me know what the German word for pastries are, okay? No, no! No, it wasn't, no, it wasn't the German word for pastry. It was literally the German the word, for jelly, word for jelly donut. Okay, oh, that makes it better. No, everyone knows the German word for jelly donut. I mean, I thought, I thought everyone did. 
Uh, yeah, right. So this is the one where you pick a category. Well, apparently I can't do sports and leisure because that's jelly donuts. No, not the geography. I'm so bad. Uh, which country citizens has the longest life expectancy? Uh, oh. Uh, so this is the one yeah. where, yeah, you... Yeah, you, you gotta pick one and then... Yeah, you pick in order based on And you your, can't pick one that someone else has already picked. Yeah, and it's based on your score. The lower score you are, the first the first you go. <laughs> Firster you go. Uh, oh, it's Monaco. Really? Monaco? Monaki, Monakians? Monacoans? I love how the United States is the lowest out of all of those. Are you surprised? No, not in the least. <laughs> have you seen us? <laughs> I have. We've also seen all the other countries with free health care. Oh. oh, which of these countries get the highest share of electricity from renewable non-nuclear sources? I'm going to say Denmark, because they have all of those one meals. I'm going to say Sweden, for similar reasons. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> really... <laughs> so, renewable non well, it's not the other two. <laughs> I mean, it could be China. Yeah. Oh, uh, check Sweden. No, <laughs> it's not Sweden. All right. Yeah, uh, I knew China was before the United States. Yep, yeah, and I knew Nicaragua had to be better than both of them. Good so. old Sweden. Right. Hey, you guys grabbed Sweden and Denmark, and I was like, well, it's clearly going to be those two. <laughs> Time to bring your A game. Your eyes are so creepy. The girls are not cool in this. According to UNESCO, which of these countries held the highest total box office revenue in 2011? So, movies. Really? Interesting. Well, why Good not? Choice. They have more people. Uh, no. <laughs> but, no. Bollywood. Bollywood, uh, Bollywood makes all the money. Yeah, but anime. Yeah, but box, yeah, box, nobody actually pays. Box office revenue. Not where things are made, Let's where things are watched. But really? Yeah. So it was USA. Oh uh, damn. I I went on a on a chance on China. I'm surprised Japan is higher than China. Yeah, I'm I am I'm a little surprised. I didn't realize that America was that high in the box offices. What do you according, think we do? According yeah. to the United Nations, which of these regions contains the most countries as of twenty fourteen? I'm in last all of a sudden. Oh no. Uh it's either Asia or I think it's Africa. All right. I'm going to go with Asia, then. Uh, those are the two I was oh, between. Then I'm going to go Europe. Yep. Although it could have been the Caribbean. Watch it be the Caribbean, and they've got <laughs> Petro wanted Europe. Here's the breakdown. Uh, yep. Yay, wow. Europe had 53. I think Europe and Asia share some countries, Europe too. isn't big, but they have a lot of little tiny countries. Yeah, they true. One last question. All right. It's your chance Throw to rock change it up, have, player three. Have it skip over a country. I mean, yeah, pretty much. Entertainment or sports oh, and leisure? I don't like either of these. One sports has baking. Dang it. <laughs> he tried to play the I, baking card on I, I hate entertainment. Well, I like entertainment, but I hate their entertainment questions. As of 2013, which of these actors starred in the film with the highest score on RottenTomatoes.com? Oh, the God. highest score on Rotten Tomatoes. What? As of 2013. Jennifer Lawrence. Uh, Pretty sure she was Mystique by then. I, he never wins until he finally did, but I gotta go with Leo. Yeah, Leo's probably a good one. Oof. I'm trying to think when uh, when did uh, Django come out? Yeah, that's that's what I'm. Uh, I think it was after 2013 though. I'm I'm gonna stick with Jamie Fox though, cause I don't think that Brad Pitt or jo Angelina Jolie get well. Scoring What about movies. Mr. and Mrs. Smith? Very low scoring on Rotten Tomatoes. Jamie Foxx did terribly. Oh, and Jango was out. It was Brad Pitt. It was Brad Pitt. 12 Years a Slave. Really? Well, there you go. Rotten Tomatoes. I don't understand you sometimes. Rotten Tomatoes is weird. I think the people who use Rotten Tomatoes aspire to be critics. Well, no, because there's, there's basically... Three groups of people who use Rotten Tomatoes. Oh god, now I'm in last league. Uh, it's either legitimate, legitimate, legitimate film critics who I can't trust because they like things that nobody else likes. Uh, Reddit users who tank things based on other reasons other than the movies themselves. Uh, and then people who actually watch movies. Round <laughs> three. All right. It's 
Switchigory. It's Switchigory. Hey, so this is the one where you pick a category, and if you get the one that you picked correctly, then you get extra bonus points. Right. And you get to go first. Yep, pick so this one just goes in order, everybody gets two. History Entertainment. God uh, dang it. <laughs> you should have did history. Is it nope. Uh, what? what Canadian singer was rocking in the free world the release of the 1989 album Freedom? I didn't know any of these people were Canadian. Uh, uh, uh oh. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I know rock music! Take it! I. This is not Bruce Springsteen, he's from Jersey. I don't know. Yeah, I look. Better luck next time. I did, I actually did know that. Y'all worried me for a second when everyone picked Let's Bruce. The categories. I was Player scared. Uh, look, I, man. I don't listen to music. Uh, well, I mean, that's... I do, but I don't. Man, I feel like. <laughs> what sports team is, er, uh, yeah, what sports item is chilled before used to prevent bouncing? To prevent bouncing? To prevent bouncing. Uh, three seconds. I went with the, the oddball. I, it, Dang it. What? But it's... Oh, whatever. Yeah, that made it's too much to sense. go on the ice, guys. No, I, yeah, I know, know, but I would... They like, chill, it, they chill okay. it before putting it on the ice? Yeah. Choose wisely. That seems but silly. Otherwise, it'll bounce on the ice. I thought that was too obvious of an answer, so I went yeah. with one was like, a horseshoe. Horseshoes are usually played in the south. I know, but they put it in the freezer. No. Where did two thirds of the world's population of fur seals, like the uh, those back there, go to breed every year? Uh, uh, basically, which which ocean? Three of these are on one ocean. I think that sounds correct. I'm gonna go with that one. Oh, uh, we split it. Yay! Good old Alaska. I second guessed myself. Oh my lord, I'm doing so bad. I'm trying to catch up to Petra. Yeah. Well, here's yeah. an interesting development. I didn't get bonus points for my question, but I'll answer everyone else's questions. Just fine. Science and nature. All right. Well, I get to try science and nature again. What kind of data storage hosted by third-party data center is accessible from any device anywhere? I know it! <laughs> Petra, <laughs> why? <laughs> Petra, that's literally local area network. That's the opposite of a cloud. See, I didn't even know what that stood for. It stands for <laughs> local area network. Yeah. <laughs> You're hitting my... Okay. Choose carefully, player one. There Entertainment are... or sports and leisure. God dang it! <laughs> <laughs> it worked so well for me last time. Yeah, you should have learned from your mistake. Dang it, Springsteen. <laughs> In what film did Russell Crowe play Maximus Decimus Meridius? What the hell? Meridius. That's what I, I said. I don't know what any of these are. Okay, uh, we're just gonna pick one. Th try to think it logically. Eeny, are... meeny, miny. No, that's not I, what I, I meant. I like this three logic. Se three seconds. Uh, pick one, pick go. one. You've chosen Yeah. Correctly. I was gonna say, think it about was it. was the top three. We well, couldn't figure out which one. I was gonna say, even if you've never seen the movie, think of the name Maximus Decimus Meridius. Well, That's three, Roman. Well, 300 is for the Romans. 300 is for the Spartans. Nice work. It's close. Which is but Greek. They're, but they're fighting against the Romans. Still Greek. So no, they're fighting against the Persians. The Persians. Then the centurion is a, or is a Roman soldier. So it could have been any of them. Uh, Mach 1 refers to the speed of what? Money. Apparently not thought. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's clever. Uh, we're going to go with that one. I think that's wrong. Rolling that is around wrong. at the speed well, we, we have airplanes that can go like Mach 6 at this point. I don't know. Look, maybe they're going six times the speed of light. That's, you don't know. No. <laughs> we have not yet hit the speed of light in that. transportation. Look at you over there with your four in a row. Player Look, three, I figured out it's time how to change much. categories. Oh no. You guys are not. Oh, oh why? Excellent. <laughs> I like it because James don't. I'm at last. Oh, I'm not in well, Which of these is an official language of Papua New Guinea? Uh, that one. Uh, I believe it's this one, but I could be wrong. I mean, it's... Oh boy, I second guess myself. Damn it! it English? Alright. What? Alright. 
Well dang. <laughs> Guys, we're getting... No, no, you're still beating Petra now, Lee. Barely, Time but there's one question left. And she's picking the category. Uh, that's true. Oh, please, no! Oh, yes, oh no! Look, it could be anything. It could be baking. It could be. For which of these soccer teams did David Beckham not oh, play? Oh, dang it! Um... What? I mean, I have no idea. I'm not a soccer guy. I'm gonna guess... I'm gonna guess he didn't play for us. Yay! Yay! <laughs> I was like, Colorado Rapids, one of these things is not <laughs> like the other. One of these things just doesn't like, belong. Uh, oddly enough, of the four, I knew that he played for Manchester United. That was yeah. the only one that I knew. That was also the only one I knew. I don't sports. <laughs> I don't sports much, place, but David Beckham is like one of the three most well-known soccer stars of all time. He, he, he can bend it. First he can bend it all. I don't <laughs> all right, I'm ahead of Petra for now. What scores do we need to get our next wedge? I'm a hundred away from another wedge. I don't want to talk about I it. I think we have what one more category before before final yeah, final we'll jeopardy. Yeah, it's round. wrong game, but yeah. All right, and this uh, should this be grab bag, blitz. Blitz. grab bag blitz. So this is got to pick the answers quickly. You gotta go fast. Act fast. You gotta know the answer and then pick it before someone else does. Yeah. Oh, and you're in behind so you pick the category. Round, Keep in mind that whichever one you pick, no. we're gonna do four rounds of. Yeah. Should have did baking. The it's, baking category. It's not the baking category. Which of these rock groups originates from England? Uh. Oh. Oh shit. Uh, I'm already out. Uh, the lead singer was from Scotland, though. Dang it! Oh, there it is. Not England, but I. Th oh yeah, Scotland. Originating from England. I was just thinking you're, not you're American. Not, you're not out, out, Lee. Oh, I'm not out, out. Great. Uh, Zeppelin. Dang it! I knew that. I was gonna say I can do this. Uh, in excess. Nope. Four more. <laughs> Dang! Nail it, Petra. It's, she yeah. did. I didn't know Pink Floyd was... Yeah, I, I didn't know. I, I I read from England, and I was like, the lead singer of ACDC is from Scotland. I went looking for the Beatles and never saw it, and then I at the, the very end... Round. As of 2013, which of these film stars also released a music album. Music album? Uh, uh nope. Billy Bob Thornton. Uh, Jamie Foxx. Uh, I would have loved to have heard Steven a, Seagal. a Tom Hanks music album. Right? Uh, Colin Farrell. Nope. Keanu Reeves, really? Yeah. And I knew Russell Crowe did, too. actually makes sense. I want to get the Russell Crowe one. It's still anyone's That's game. awesome. Everybody gave him shit for for the musical. Right, which of these characters are from the I haven't film seen film this Matrix. one! Uh, no, this is literally the only one I know. I know all of them. Uh, we know all of them. Which one, which one, which one you want, Lee? Uh, I'm gonna go right over here in the corner. I, I haven't oh, seen yeah. it yet! Don't help! That's cheating. And then Dozer's the last one. Yeah. Dude, but they have some great ones from, uh, frickin' Reboot. Yeah, they do. The yeah, Dot Matrix. Bong. <laughs> That's great. Which of these TV series was produced by Nickelodeon? Oh, this one I can do. Oh, yeah! Global Guts! <laughs> Lee went straight for Dora the Explorer. Dora, yeah. Dora, Dora, the Explorer. Uh, uh, Wild Thornberries. Uh, Cartoon Network, Cartoon Network. Cartoon Network. Lots of cart, lots of Cartoon Network. Planet Sheen. I can see a couple new other ones. Uh, I think that's all. Oh. Oh. Yeah, Keenan and Kel and Rabbit's Baby. Yeah, I was like, Keenan and Kel. I was going through this whole thing going, that's Cartoon Network, that's Cartoon Network, that's Cartoon Network. The, Cartoon only, Network. the only reason I knew Invader Zen is because you were making you watch it. We just started making her watch it. <laughs> she's, she's the young blood. Ah, uh, yes! My mom did me no favors with my childhood. It's okay, it just means we get to watch it all now. It's Which of these comic books were written by Alan Moore? I don't know who this person Ooh. is! Alan Moore, I think he did, nope. <laughs> I, Batman. No. I thought that Alan Moore was Batman. Apparently, I was wrong. V for Vendetta. I haven't seen that. Either. Oh, I think. Oh, wait. I do know one more. <laughs> Let me in there. <laughs> no, Petra. I was wrong. Cool. Thank you, Petra, for getting that in front of me. Uh, extraordinary gentleman. Watchman. That's it. That's all we have time for. Super violent. 
Yeah, Mushroom is fantastic. Lost Girls, Marvel Men, Fashion Beast. Yeah, I, I apparently didn't know Alan Moore. I thought I did. I was wrong. I was horrifically wrong. It's okay. You just gotta think of the weird ones. Apparently. He wrote all the weird ones. Is Alan Moore the guy that like doesn't know how women's spines work? Uh, no, that's, uh... Uh, oh look! We're all of us that It's not Alan Moore. Yeah. Mainly because you're thinking of an artist kind of writer. That that but, makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> but I know who you're talking about, I can't think of his name right now. Lee, for all of your complaining about the entertainment, you have three entertainment wedges! That's because all we're picking is entertainment. Yeah, it's like, if I'm gonna get wedges, I have to make do with what you give me. Uh, he's winning, man. And look, they gave me a bunch of questions on rock music and comics. Uh, it's uh, it's entertainment, man. All right, final round. It's literally 50-50 shot. Oh, uh, yeah. geography. <laughs> Great. Geography. Eiffel Tower oh, or Lean Tower no. Pisa? Uh, uh, this is a German observation post from World oh. War II. I know... Yeah. That it's not the Eiffel Tower because they uh, oh, they clipped yeah. the they clipped the well, elevator so that they couldn't go up. Dang. Category. Well, I'm already. It was, it was hilarious. Lunch. And Italy was part it of the It a restaurant. I mean, it's just you. Like, one second. Yeah. yeah as if I had France, to assume, France has the restaurants. I think I knew that because of Miraculous Ladybug. Actually. Probably. Actually, uh, yeah. Is it's a, a bell, bell tower. tower. There's no bell in the Eiffel. The tension is rising. I didn't know there was one in Pisa, but I knew there I mean, wasn't one sense. in the Eiffel. It does. Oh god! Uh, I can't see! Get, get out! Get out of here! I uh, can't see! Oh lord! Um, Seriously? Pick, um, just pick one! Is that tall? <laughs> hey! <laughs> lucky! Ah, uh, that wasn't fair. That wasn't fair. <laughs> the game just <laughs> pulled it off. <laughs> That was, that was rude, game. I mean, to be fair, to would you have known which one was history. which tall? No! I would have gone with Carnegie or Rockefeller? Helped fund the University of Chicago. I don't know! Uh, I did the wrong one. Rockefeller uh, was New York. Sorry. I was wrong. Dang it. I was wrong and I was, because I was right. What? No. <laughs> Alright, I need you to get this wrong. Wrote that the man who dies thus rich dies disregarded. Disgraced. Disgraced? I can read! I can't read. Someone else read. Rockefeller had all of the money, so it wasn't him. Well, they both had a lot of money. Well, yeah, but he kept a lot of his uh, money. Uh, was born in Scotland. Well, one of these sounds Scottish. <laughs> and the contest continues. Alright, keeping it going, keeping it going. Uh, organized the Standard Oil Company. Yeah. Uh, I knew every question but the first. It's unfortunate. I don't know any of these questions. Uh, was the world's first billionaire? Uh-oh. No, well, you're correct. I say, even if I was wrong, we both got it. Uh, here we go. Everyone who got their questions right gets So James is now handily winning. But now we're going into science, so who knows? Technology, biology, chemistry, space. It's all Apes or monkeys? Great. Nature. Have no tails. That's yeah, that's an easy one. But I don't think it's gonna stay that easy. <laughs> uh, count chimpanzees among their species. Uh, chimps have tails, right? Chimps are apes. Are they? Sorry, yep. yep. But Answers chimps have tails. No, they don't. They don't. Nope. No. I thought Abu was a chimp. No. Dang They're it. Generally smaller. Take that, uh, Petra. Petra's Get out, out of here. One wrong answer, and you're out until the a next category. Abu is very much just a monkey. They don't ever tell you what he is. Yeah. Includes our species, Homo sapiens. So we don't have tails. Who's it gonna be? Oh, some you some people are born with tails. We have the potential that's, that's for true. a tail. That's true. Uh, I have more species. Ooh. Bone monkeys. Well, you both get the wedge and either the way. Alright, I'll take it. Yeah, now who's handily tied with me? <laughs> Why am I I'm doing handily so well tied with you. I don't understand. I'm not good at science. No, you're better Clearly at science you than you think you are. Oh no! Yeah. Give me food! <laughs> food! Boxing or MMA? Great. Uh, it's an Olympic sport. Uh, uh, it's boxing! Damn it. Well. There goes my... There goes your chance. Yeah. Chance. Known as the sweet, sweet science. science. Also boxing. Yeah. Oh, there's going to be a winner oh, right here. Oh, right no. Now. Either way. 
We, oh, we, no. we could tie. We could tie. A lot of fighting on the ground. Huh. Well, it's not boxing. Yeah, it's some real dirty boxing if you fight <laughs> on the ground. No. Alright. Uh, uh, limits championship fights to five rounds. I'm pretty sure boxing goes way longer than Hang that. Hang in there. That's correct. Is there even a set limit on rounds in boxing? Uh, yes, but it's high. Uh, sanctioned by the WBA, WBC, and WBO. I'm going to assume that the, the, B, the B stands, stands for boxing. For boxing. So we have a tie. I've never seen this before. What do we do? I don't know. What does the game do for us? I don't know, James. Do, do we just end this as a tie? Ladies uh, and gentlemen. Yay, gave it to me. What? <laughs> Why? No, he doesn't. I, I, I went he does in. Though. He no, answered, we, we have he, the exact same amount of points. Did you answer the last question faster? Maybe? I don't know how they split it. Uh, they just... I call shenanigans. Uh, victory is mine. Uh, so not, many categories. Sure. So Look at many... how consistent I am. Uh, I mean, I'm going to take the win. I'm sure you I, will. I take those. <laughs> Look, I'm... I will take the satisfaction in knowing that I tied you in score, even if the game yeah. says I took that, that was I'm happy. That was a perfect tie, which I've never seen in this game, so I don't know if they just toin, uh, yeah, toin toss it. Toin toss. If they coin toss it, or if there's another metric that they look at. Yeah. But uh, either way... It could be... Um, uh, I'm the trivia maybe, master. Maybe the number you got in a row correct? Maybe. Yeah, you were streak. yeah. streaks. Yeah, a lot yeah. of good streaks. So, yeah. Who knows? So, I don't, I, all I know is I'm taking it. I'm uh, running away with this win. Yeah. And we, we all beat the AI, so yeah, the yes, AI came all, last. We all beat Petra. So team victory. Yeah. And uh, that was Trivia Pursuit. So I guess we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.